ben eigenlijk een beetje klaar met de traagheid van de politiek. En dat zeg ik ook constant van, de klimaatopwarming gaat daar niet op wachten. We zullen pijn in de oos, we zullen blijven gaan strijken totdat ze iets doen. Veel mensen zeggen dat we niet genoeg doen om de klimaatopwarming te strijden. Dat de politici niet genoeg doen. Maar ik... I disagree with that because to not do enough, you have to do something, and we are basically not doing anything right now. Ze zeggen allemaal, ja, we zijn er al kei lang mee bezig. Als je er al zo lang mee bezig wordt, oké, laat zien wat jullie gedaan, wat gaan jullie doen? Er is gewoon niks. Er is echt niks in België. Meeting with the other girls. I usually don't like talking to people, but these people are good. What was for you the most important thing last week? Yeah, I think also Greta had to meet. It's 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 brilliant. We have had a really nice conversation and so. And also in Paris, strike. I found it amazing to see that also in another country, not Sweden or Belgium, but there also a lot of energy lives to do it. Because that has me really convinced that this is just a world thing. I think it's it's good that journalists are are writing about this and reporting about this, but sometimes they are a bit intense. I I have Asperger's syndrome, and if I would take all that in, I wouldn't be able to do anything. So I just shut off. It's like it's like a version of autism. It makes me different. I I am a bit different from people. I don't like really participating in the social game and I don't I don't lie and I I I can't just say something and then do another thing so it's and also I think that if I would have been like everyone else then I would just have continued like everyone else then I would never have began the, the strike because then I would just have been like everyone else Het meeste dat ik ook hoor van negatieve reacties gaat over uh, mijn gender en bijvoorbeeld bij Greta over Asperger. En dan denk ik, dat is heel stom dat wij opkomen voor het klimaat. En omdat je kunt echt wel niet tegen het klimaat zijn, want dat is zo'n groot probleem. Dat gaat letterlijk iedereen aan. Dat mensen dan op de persoon uh, beginnen bashen eigenlijk, is in dat jammer en dat is ook totaal niet zinvol. Of course, there are going to be many negative reactions. You can't do anything without getting negative reactions because then you're not standing up for anything. And uh, so I think that's, that's just good. They, that they see us as a threat. If you are not fully aware of the climate crisis, which is understandable because the climate crisis has never been treated as a crisis, then if you're not fully aware, then a school strike for the climate but must be very weird. Um, if I weren't this aware and if I didn't know anything I do about the climate crisis, I would just say that, oh, they are just skipping school. I think half of the people don't even know half of the problem. And if they would, I think they would be as active and frightened as we are. And also, as you said, I think the, the biggest and the greatest persons in history made a difference because they broke the rules and of course they they received a lot of hate as well but it's necessary to make a change the luxe Oh, ik, heb al, ik heb al zoveel positieve reacties gehad. Gewoon, mensen die echt, gewoon de mensen die zeggen dat we een verandering maken, dat is eigenlijk het enige dat ik wil horen. En dat horen we vaak trouwens. Dus ik ben, allee, als ik dat hoor, dan weet ik van oké, okay, het komt echt aan en er gebeurt iets. Ja, uh, I mean here. I don't know if we should talk about that. I think it's private. But did you have the impression that he took you seriously? Yes, actually, I, I did. I think he. It more and more now people are starting to treat us like, like adults. The more we, the longer we do this, and the longer we strike, the more 
people take us seriously. So it's it's a lot about patience, I think. I don't have a social life. I have never had a social life. But of course I have fun. Uh, but this takes up a lot of time and a lot of energy. So when uh, when we are when I am finished, I I don't have any energy left to spare on other things. Mm -hmm. But I I play a lot with my dogs and and so on. Zoals dat Greta zegt, dat mijn leven nog veel leuker is geworden. Gewoon door mensen te ontmoeten zoals Louisa en Greta en Adelaide en samen gaan strike in Parijs. En we zijn gewoon grote dingen aan het doen. En natuurlijk, ik heb totaal geen leven meer daarbuiten. Maar ik vind dat totaal niet erg eigenlijk. En ik vind dat geweldig om, om dan tijd te spenderen met mensen die echt iets te zeggen hebben. All that will remain of our political leaders' legacy will be the greatest failure of human history. I don't know, but hopefully I won't be working with the climate because that means everything is fixed. But I probably will. <laughs> I will continue until Sweden is in line with the Paris Agreement and then I hope that people from all around the world are trying to do the same for their country and the world. And also, as we say all the time, it's, it's not a question of whether we stop, it's a question of whether they begin. Thank you. <laughs>